Hi guys, it's your the math person. Today I'll be going over question 205 on the SO exam P. So pause the video quick and try this problem yourself. Okay, so you're, you're, you're the 10th, so let's just dive right in. Um, T is modeled by a uniform distribution, 0 to 10. 0 to 10. And expectant war expect extended warranty pays a benefit of 100 if a failure occurs between 1.5 and T is equal to 8. So here. And then stub u, this benefit, is modeled by this thing right here. And we're trying to look for the probability that the ben benefit is less than 79. Okay, so if the benefit is less than 79, that includes the part where benefit is equal to 0. So benefit is equal to 0 right here, right? 0 to 1.5 and 8 to 10. So let's figure that out. When benefit is equal to 0, this is equal to... We know all probability distribution for a uniform distribution is just 1 over b minus a, where b is equal to 10 and a is equal to 0. So our, this is going to be 1 over 10 here, because it's uniform. And what's the area of that? Well, from here to here, the difference is 1.5 minus 0. That's 1.5. And the difference here is just 10 minus 8, which is 2. So the probability that it is 0, the benefit is 0, is 1.5 plus 2 over 10 or also known as 3.5 over 10. What is the probability when w is between 0 and w? 0 and 79, I mean. <laughs> we know that w is equal to this thing right here. And we, so we can little, perform a little transformation because we don't know the probability in terms of w, but we do know the probability in terms of t. It's a uniform distribution right here. So we can actually just do that right here. So we'll do a little transformation. 0 is less than w, which is 100. e to negative 0.004t is less than 79. So I can divide each side by 100. 0 less than e to negative 0.004. Oh, it's 0.04t is less than 0.79. I can take the natural log of both sides. Probability of 0 is less than negative 0.04t is less than natural log of 0.79 and finally I'm going to divide both sides by negative 0.04 but remember when I divide both any side inequality by negative the sign flips it becomes this way t natural log of 0.79 divided by negative 0.04 so this is equal to the probability that t is greater then natural log of 0.79 divided by negative 0.04, which is equal to 5.893. But we know the probability of 5.893 is like here. So the w here is going to be bounded by the upper limit of 8. right? Because we already figured out the probability from here to here. And we already figured out the probability from here to here. So if we count this part again, we're double counting this part. And also the w is only true for when one t is less than 8. So we know the upper limit here is 8. So the probability that t is greater than 5.93 is bounded by 8 minus 5.893. And then the, again, the probability distribution is just 1 over 10. So 10 here. So this is equal to 8 minus this number divided by 10. So this is 2.1 divided by 10. So all I have to do to figure out the probability that W is less than 79 is just add those two numbers, 3.5 over 10 plus 2.1 over 10, which is equal to 0 0.56069 on on, which is approximately equal to 0.56, which is your answer D. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. Otherwise, as always, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. Bye!